This is the Encore, a brand new subcompact SUV from Buick. It's got some things going for it, but overall, I'm kind of confused by it. This isn't just a small SUV, this is a really small SUV. I mean, there's just not a lot of room back here. If you got kids, I don't think they're gonna like this too much. The best thing about the Encore is definitely driving it. It feels light, nimble, pretty quick. The steering has good feel to it and is very responsive. I like that a lot. The suspension is stiffer than you'd expect from a Buick, but to be honest, with a vehicle this tall, it needs to be to give you decent handling, and this one definitely does. The only complaints I got were from my backseat passengers who were getting bounced around a bit. The one thing I'd really hope for is a better way to shift gears manually when you decide you want to do that. If you want to go up and down, you have to use your thumb, which is just weird and awkward. One thing I really hate is this center stack area, as it's called, where they put all the entertainment and navigation controls. It's like somebody just threw a bunch of buttons on there and said, hey man, you figure it out. There's no organization to it. You know, I'm still a little bit confused about who the customer for this car is. On the one hand, it seems ideal for young people. It's quick, it's nimble, but it's also a little bit pricey. And besides, young people just don't buy Buicks. On the other hand, it seems like it could be great for retirees, you know, people whose kids have already left the house and moved on. But uh, I thought those are the folks that Buick was supposed to be trying to move away from.